Hi Collective, welcome to the channel. I'm Crystal, a Divine Psychic Medium, delivering messages to you from the higher realm. So welcome everyone. So this is going to be a late night reading. Okay. It's like the middle of the night, I guess. <laughs> yeah. Alright, so I've had a lot going on today with family. Oh my goodness, it being so hot. <laughs> Hopefully the fan's not too loud. I've got a fan on my desk. Another one, bigger one. <laughs> okay. So let's get into this. So um, a lot's going on within my family. So whenever it is, I'm more guided to like family readings, right? So. You know, this might not be everybody's story. If it's not, then um, don't take it. <laughs> take it every fill is for you. Whenever I'm guided to the witch's garden, um, there's something going on in the family. Ooh, look, the devil in the chariot. All right. So there's, um, I feel like I've been trying to, like, make more space today. I'm trying to figure out something else. Mm, maybe it's this energy like you're waiting for something to be right okay chariot here there's some sort of movement like normally I'm so particular about the camera the lighting and normally like I'm set up like I've been like I feel I've just got to bring what's going on like with me today and normally I do right but I'm always like looking for messages and signs but today I'm just going to be talking about like um what I've been doing, like, I've been really simplifying things and, like, trying to, like, I had a bunch of other, like, lighting and different things, and I'm, like, there are cords everywhere. I've got so many different things. Like, for the longest time, I've had, like, my router out in my main living space, right? And then whenever I want to upload, I've got to take my laptop, disconnect everything, and then I go set it up, right? And then to get quiet, I'll go sit out on my patio and run cords and just this big thing, right? Just to upload. And I'm just like, why don't I just bring the router and put it next to my computer and plug it in <laughs> so I can upload there? Seriously, like, uh, I don't know what, the, what that is. Like, I don't, like, I don't know. It's one of those things because it's like they say to get the best signal, right? Because I get it through the phone service, right? So I, I tap into there wirelessly right so they're like we'll put it by window so that's why initially like i done that but so maybe there's something like that like maybe you need to do something like not according to the rules or something like that right there's definitely victory and success here six of wands and definitely too i'm like well yeah i'm gonna get to do a lot more working things like that because especially with it being hot a lot of times i'm like oh i'm just gonna upload them real quick i'm not even gonna edit and this is going to bother me like if my camera's shaking I'm sorry because now I've got my cam back on my computer instead of having it set up on something I don't know so there's something about that right making more space okay like I feel somebody's going to be simplifying something right with the chariots movement direction Charge control. All right. It told me I need to look at the cards more. Okay. There's something with the devil here, right? Maybe this is somebody that's had some sort of stronghold or control over you. And maybe you're going to be taking back control. You know, like I realized that like if somebody controls you with money and resources, when you're like, yeah, it doesn't bother me anymore. Yeah, seven of swords. They don't know how to control you anymore, right? <laughs> you know, just like I was, I was getting into it with my boyfriend like the other day, and he's like, I go to work every day, I provide for da 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 and I'm just like, um, like, I was like, I know, I appreciate that, but also that doesn't fix your behavior and how you treat me and all this stuff. I'm like, you know, like, it's not all about money and providing for and all of that. You know, it's like, well, what can I do? Like, on Friday, like, I'll buy you anything. I'll do that. I'm like, no, you can't just buy me anything to fix it, right? Like, it's, you know, like, 
it's one of those things like maybe somebody got to buy a lot before or whatever but <laughs> I was like, yeah, just like you have all the money in the world. Like it, do it doesn't fix things. You can't just buy things and cover it up, right? It's definitely the energy that um, is coming out. So somebody's like, <laughs> somebody could be trying to like control you with money resources, or maybe they did in the past and now they can't. All right, so Seven of Swords, Lies, and Betrayal. Maybe you found out about that. See, like, that's Two of Cups. Like, that's what I was finding out, right? It's like he was lying and hiding things again, right? Um, so, you know, that's why I'm just like, all the money in the world is not going to fix, you know, your lies, hiding your betrayals, you know? And he was getting tempted by the devil, right? So, and he was failing he was you know so if this isn't like energy directly related to you it could be real um affecting somebody close to you but this seven of swords still shown with the lover and the two of cups for some of you you know like you could be realizing that straight up like a lover was after you for finances resources money or you them <laughs> Right. Sometimes you guys trauma bond too, especially in today's times. Like um, a lot of times, people will stay in relationships longer than they should because of shared resources, finances, things like that. I recently got guided to. There's actually a term where somebody will like use sex as a way to like get a place to stay. Like somebody will sleep with somebody for a place. Like somebody could it could be staying or in a relationship or something like that because of fear of homelessness. I mean, it, I I can't believe there's like a term for it. Like people sleep with anybody. I don't know if it's like you go out there like you offer that like I'll sleep with you if you let me stay with you, or if it's just like. So many people get into those relationships, I feel, where they rely on each other for finances. Sometimes people don't realize they're doing it, too. And they get into relationships and people are, like, automatically will look for the benefit, right? Like, I know, like, I didn't even see that, right? Like, when I got together with my boyfriend, right? Like, I had my own house, my own car, you know, my own money, all of those things. And, like, you know, he was living with his mom. And he didn't have those things. All right, I don't want to get too much of my personal story. I know it's in my mind, okay. <laughs> I just keep looking at the Seven of Swords, Two of Cups. Like, like, I don't even think he realized that he trauma bonded to me. And then I was like driving like every weekend to go pick him up so he could come stay with me. death card there's an ending here look there's an offering somebody could be coming around trying to offer something to that is done somebody's coming back around like there's already been something that's happened i feel that i mean past present or future energy take it how you feel it fitting but the way i'm reading it is like Something has already happened. Something has already been exposed with the Seven of Swords. So an ending has already happened. And now there's like an offering. And it might not be directly to you. Somebody could be offering something to a child or trying to use the children, right? To offer something. That was how my lover came back, too. Like I had already separated from him for a month, right? And I was figuring things out because I was like, I don't need your money. Like, no, I'll find a way to provide everything, this lifestyle, even though I gave up last everything. Like, I'll figure it out on my own, right? And then, like, my son was getting into trouble and he got locked up and had court and all this stuff. And he went and got him for me and brought him back. So I was like, you're helping me out with my son. I'm all alone. It's just me. <laughs> so 
six of swords somebody almost got like i get like kind of like taken advantage of energy like she's got all those swords in her back and she's got a sword in her hands and her little baby and there's like the looks like a grim reaper right in the in there it's kind of like she's forced to get into that boat like i have no choice kind of like what i was talking about right it was like well there's a lot of swords here like i don't know how like six six of swords is about moving away but it's the six to the seven i feel something is coming to cause movement i don't know why it's like all scattered well this is the energy today Like, I've had so much attacks, too, and so many different things coming at me today. I was forced to meditate, too, for a little while so I could get some downloads. Like, I know when they force me to lay down, too. Like, all of a sudden, my eyes look at just so heavy, and I'm like, all right, all right, I'm going. <laughs> I'll go lay down. And then I'm going to fall asleep like that. And then it gets downloads, right? Full card energy, Nine of Cups. See, there's a new love offer coming in. There's something, too, with this green. It's like I was feeling green, right? <laughs> Before this reading. And I did my nails, too. I was feeling green. And then I, went, I was going to get my green bracelets, too. But I'm like, Shh, those are all the way over there. Like, on the other side of, like, ten bracelets. <laughs> hmm. Something's definitely depleting your energy. Six of Wands again. See, and then the Queen of Swords reversed. I had something really trying to get me in this energy today. But I feel I had victory over it. Because I transmuted it. Wow. Like, this is all over the place. This isn't going to be one of my normal readings, probably because it's like 2.30 a.m. 2.33, I just seen 2.12.33. Yeah, totally depleted all my energy today where I couldn't do a reading. But it aggravates me because I like to do a reading every day. Like, I feel lost if I don't sit down. And I know it's good to take a break, right? Like, I was getting the reference today, like, um, that you need to take breaks with things you need to give things a rest sometimes for producti productivity to keep going right for you like um it's good to have that spiritual cleanse purge right where you walk back into because it it's like if you keep doing something over and over and over again like i don't even know where i got this reference today but they're showing me a couple different examples but one of them is like kneading dough you know how like if you when you knead dough you then have to stop and let it rise and then knead it again or bake it or whatever but it it's like if you keep just working really really hard at it and kneading it you'll ruin it if you don't give it time to breathe you know rest oh, like here's another thing that I did <laughs> like okay this is like probably how out of it I was is it was so mad that it's so hot right and I'm like I'm gonna clean my AC like really good because like I I take it apart right and I clean you know and stuff and um I normally just wipe it down vacuum it or whatever and clean around the coils and all of that but I don't know why today I was like let me get some some water right and really clean the um coil right and I'm like I should shut it off I know I should but no I'm gonna leave it on because <laughs> it's just way too hot so <laughs> I cleaned it or whatever and then I was like wow these are probably like too wet so I was trying to dry it but I was like I was cleaning around the clothes or whatever anyway I just put the cover back on it and like a couple hours later all of a sudden I'm like yeah it's super hot here now like worse I'm like oh my god did I break it what did I do so I go take the cover off and it is just covered in snow and ice and I'm like oh my gosh I know it's not covered it's funny it said snow I don't know but ice and it looked like snow right <laughs> obviously you know it wasn't snow but it was covered in like the white ice the powder you know and I was like oh my gosh and I was trying to get it all off and and stuff and then I noticed I'm like oh my gosh like I'm about to like freeze you know 
it's about to freeze up right so to power it off right so of course i had to let it sit with it being off not running power from it right hopefully it's okay i just turned it back on because i'm like i cannot sleep with it being hot just it's not gonna happen right <laughs> so but it's one of those things see i did let my ac have a break right so <laughs> I still can't believe that. I just didn't think that, yeah, this this is going to turn to ice. Okay. Anyways, maybe you're realizing some, like I told you, like a lot of things, like I'm, I'm starting to realize that I'm not seeing things as, as I should, right? <laughs> Nine of Cups energy came out. Ooh, she's levitating. I mean, getting something about levitating today too. And the power of energy, manipulating energy. So interesting too. One of my um, one of my star family members was talking about um, in one of her readings earlier. I wrote it down. I take notes on it. She's so cute. Um, but, yeah. I don't know which notebook though. I've been writing down so much. Stuff. Oh look, here it is. Yeah, uh, electro, electro, electrokinesis, right? So, um, manipulating energy, but using, um, using energy. And she was talking about how some have the power to, um, generate the electricity, right? Because you can create some, can, you can very much create electricity with your hands, right? And she was talking about, the phones right and I've noticed that bursts of electri electricity and electronics like there's been times that just things happen with my devices right where I'm not trying to have them do things and it's just like they power up they turn on they turn off right TVs things like that um just like with street lights anytime I'm anywhere near a street light okay <laughs> it's not all of them it's it's like the ones that are flickering or the ones that are off. If they're off, they'll turn on. If the ones that, you know, any of the ones that like have a malfunction. Maybe I've noticed that, yeah, it's never been new devices. It's been like used, like literally like, um, I've literally went through like five microwaves, not even playing, just in a couple years time. And I don't even like microwaves. I think it's so bad. I get them for my kids because it's hard when it's like, you know, they want to eat kid food, right, after school or whatever. And it's not always, I mean, there's been a couple instances in my son where he started things that's led to those. But some of them have literally just been haywire to coffee pots. We've had coffee pots malfunction to the, you know, the Keurigs, all that stuff. Those toasters. My last toaster is a digital one. I used to like to watch the time with malfunctions. All, all, all sorts of stuff with electronics between me and my, my star children. But I thought it was so cute because it was like, I just always thought it was like a star seed thing. I mean, well, it is. But it's just neat that there's a label behind it. So I'm super excited to be investigating that. Um... <laughs> I'm, this is, maybe I should just be talking about what I learned today. <laughs> oh, okay, I'm trying to just see. Maybe they don't want me playing with cards, right? <sighs> but I'm curious to see what, what's coming out. All I know is all these swords. Look, three of swords, five of swords, nine of swords. Didn't I tell you I was feeling a lot of swords and before I even knew? And it's like sword, 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 sword full card there's this new beginning here but see it's like somebody just doesn't want you to have it i really feel that somebody's heartbroken yeah they're feeling this energy like somebody is really realizing that they um betrayed their blessing they betrayed somebody it was like their blessing and um they're embarrassed they sabotage themselves and um yeah there's a tower moment happening now right. 
See, somebody's like definitely like given up on the plan or what was written. See, the book is back there with flowers in it. Like somebody's like, the fairies are doing something here. Because there's a fairy behind him with the flowers. That's interesting. I was getting something too earlier about like, um, like the fairies are on this too. Like the fays, they're bringing in like romance, love. They're bringing in like a new connection. Yeah, because it keeps seeing this Knight of Cups next to the Wheel of Fortune. There's definitely a new connection that is being guided in. Maybe for some of you, you're being guided to some hermit energy. I never realized how many fairies were in this. I mean, you should know, right? It's the witch's garden. See the three of pentacles and they see more fae. Like there's a collaboration coming together. And see, look how they're catching you. See how those children are falling out of the tower? Sorry, now my camera's all flipped too. They're falling out of the tower here, right? But if you look, there, look. Look at what they're orchestrating to catch the children. The fairy and what are those um, beavers? <laughs> Yeah, I'm going to say they are. Spirit's definitely orchestrating a tower. And it's like a saving. The world. There is definitely a cycle that is closing out here. I'm like so like oh my gosh ten of pentacles four of pentacles it's but I'm so drained it's so hard for me to channel messages I'm really looking forward to being able to have all of my energy and then all these little things getting in my way blocking me. I'm seeing the devil show up today. So many different people coming after me. It's just more frustrating because it's like I haven't used all my energy to do that instead of being able to do like these fun readings to help y'all. But at the same time, maybe that's why like I was told like just take a break today because they knew that I was going to need my energy for other things today. Two of Pentacles, the Moon, Page of Pentacles, Page of Cups. See, there's a big emphasis here on children with the pages here. But look, we have the Sun and the Moon coming out. Someone's balanced. This is like balanced too. Do you see that she's guiding together? This like counterparts coming together, matching Moons. Stuff has really been happening to Divine Feminines a lot, too. Really testing them. All right, can they stay balanced? Do they have their masculine energy? I'm hearing mishaps. All these mishaps and things like that. Like, I can't tell you how many, like, things have just been lost, misplaced, broken, missing. So much chaos and conf conflict today. Like, I feel very, very heavy. The Leviathan entity running rampant today. So it's just, it's just been draining of my energy, but it's just, I need to replenish it, right? And that's why they'll cause a lot of chaos and conflict and try to stop. Like, I've physically seen it, too, then when I was finally starting to relax and close my eyes and take that few minutes that I need, then all of a sudden my son was over and over and over again saying things, repeating things, da, 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 da. like, oh, my gosh. Just, these attacks are going to just be so much more 
obvious to you. It's just more just aggravating. I don't know if it's one of those because it's showing you like this change is needed. Like this just isn't working anymore. Yeah, there's just so much of that fighting. It's like this mama bird I look like to me. She's bringing in food for four children here. And they're all fighting over it. She's bringing more than enough for each of them, but they're all fighting. It's like some people just like that. Some people like the chaos and the conflict, I'm starting to realize, and like the fighting, and like the lower timelines. Yeah, judgment's being called in a situation, though. This Ten of Wands is over. Cycles are definitely closing out. I just feel there's going to be an unorthodox like conclusion or an ending or it's like throwing the book out the window it's like it was society like you know just like there's a certain plan way to do things right and maybe maybe this is even like um a contract or a written contract i don't know but it's like you're you don't even care anymore. Things need to change. And they're going to come about in different ways, right? I don't know. That's all I got. I'm going to stop. I, feel, I don't know. I feel like this made no sense. But you know what? Times I'm like, I'm just going to stop recording. This reading made no sense whatsoever. Those are sometimes readings you guys write comments and say things like, it made sense to me. It helped me. I don't know. Maybe if you get just one thing out of this reading, maybe me sharing that electro tenistas. I don't know if I'm saying it right, that I got enlightened about from my beautiful staff family member that maybe it'll help you right or maybe it's just for me to go investigate that i'm gonna go google investigate some things <laughs> all right and maybe try to get some sleep love and light to all of you bye